from your father. You enter his private restroom where no one is looking, and... Um, let's sabotage the toilet. I'd put a firecracker in his toilet. <laughs> that never gets old. Test's over. No one's ever answered quite like you. But hey, you passed. I'll open up the gate. Really? Really? All right. Congratulations, folks. We made it. Welcome to Covenant. Thanks. Hey, everybody. Oh, what a pleasant little place. We should go in, yes? You don't like this place? Hmm. I really shouldn't talk to you. Because I'm busy and all. Tell you. Oh, I heard about you. I don't recommend. I make things. We get a lot of drinks. Things for the store. Diamond City. A caravan of five comes through, you remember. Then they hey. must not. You're gonna like it here. Everyone in Covenant is so friendly and really wants to help. I hope I do. You'll like it. You'll see. Feel free to use my really don't recommend. Mark my Tell you. Oh, you're back. Isn't Covenant talk? just the best? Is it still okay to use your work? Oh, sure. Any of the material that's loose, feel free to use. It's odds and ends. Oh, but I gotta get back. From around here? God, I hope not. No, I'm just passing through. My advice is pass through sooner than later. You know anything about Stockton's caravan? Sure, I know about... Who was that again? <sighs> You're as bad as the rest of these idiots. I signed on with old man Stockton to find his lost caravan. What's left of it is just outside of town. The last stop was here, so I've been trying to put together the story. But I keep getting the runaround. Got a proposal for you. Help me find Stockton's people, and we split the reward. At least one survivor walked out of that massacre. And I intend to make good on my contract. Okay. Caps up, friend. If I help you, I want something up front. If I have your word, you'll help. I'll chip in 50 caps now. That's above and beyond the deal. All right, good. Who are we looking for? The big one is Stockton's daughter, Amelia. I didn't find any bodies of the feminine persuasion. So, uh, there's hope. If we find her... Stockton's offering a heap of caps. All right. Sounds fair. I'm in. Here's all I got on the caravan. I don't got proof, but Covenant's involved. Somehow. Okay. Let's find out. Oh, I am hurt. Enjoy your stay. Hi. Mrs. Fitzgerald runs our store. You should pay a visit. Okay. Sorry. You're kind I'm so of busy. the nervous type. Let's talk. Tell you. Oh, you're back. Isn't Covenant just the best? Do you have time for some questions? If it'll help, sure. Do you know anything about Stockton's caravan? No, sorry, they never came here. That was quick. Everyone around here is acting suspicious. What are they hiding? Hiding? Why would you think that? We're just real friendly and busy. I, I gotta go. Mm-hmm. Sure you can't tell me anything? Sure. I'll tell you. Oh, you're back. Isn't Covenant just the best? Do you have time for some questions? If it'll help, sure. Does Covenant have some sort of problem with synths? Synths? I, I mean, no. The test makes sure that none of those get in here. They promised. Let's see. It sounds like you're in trouble. I just want to help you. Oh, that's... that's nice. But no, I, I shouldn't be talking. I'm busy. Tell you. Do you need to use my tools? Do you need to use my tools? Oh, no, she doesn't want to talk. Darn it. Yeah. Tell your friends about them. 
can always use extra bits. Anybody walk? What's this? Hmm. Looks like a trader left a bedroll. No marks on it, so no way of telling if it's from Stockton's people. That was kind of weird. I don't know why that would have been a thing, but alright. That's a serious lock. Need to find a key. Let's hope someone's been careless. Let's private. Enjoy your stay. Ahem. I hope Swanson didn't give you too hard a time at the gate. If you ask me, I think he takes his job too seriously. But welcome. Everyone around here calls me Mrs. Fitzgerald. But you, cutie, can call me Penny. All right. What do you do around here? A bit of everything. I try to leave some things for the men folk to do, you know, so they feel in charge. You here to shop? I'll make sure to give you a good price. Do you have time for a few questions? For you? <laughs> Certainly. Ooh. The town looks really nice. How'd you manage that? Oh, thank you for noticing. Well, the men folk would say good old-fashioned elbow grease keeps Covenant as the prettiest place in the Commonwealth. But between you and me, I think shrewd trading may play a big part. <laughs> mm. Do you know anything about a missing caravan? You've been talking to Mr. Dan. I don't know what he's carrying on about. He's just stirring the pot, if you ask me. Definitely. He has such an attitude. I know! He's so smug. And Dan thinks he's the one helping people. He wouldn't know the first thing about making the Commonwealth a better, safer place. Whoa, she got a little... Let's, let's hit on her a little uh, bit. He should be thankful you let him in. Instead, he stomps around interrogating people. If the compound did do something to his precious caravan, they had reasons for it. Better reasons than a man like him. Oh, really? You know, honey, I... I was just shooting off at the mouth. Just forget anything I said about that and the compound. I have to go. Compound? I don't think she mentioned the compound. Okay. Hello, stranger. You got anything that ails you? I'll fix you up for a fee. Any news out there, doctor? If you want rumors, then Penny's the girl for you. I'd like to... Hmm? Not interested. All right. Well, that was interesting. Find the location of compound, huh? Hmm. Well. It got an operation going. I bet it's nearby. Hmm. Are there any structures nearby? Oh! Is that power armor? Oh my god, it's power armor! Nice. Save your life, man. And I leveled up. Can Don't we talk? scare the fish, asshole. Oh, this place is neat. What's all this? Oh. It's like their last date or something. <gasps> is that a what is that? 
that's nothing. Unless that's something, like point me something good. No? Well, alright, let's go check out this waterway. Oh my gosh, there's a door. Lucky. Well, what's going on here? Oh, people. Outsiders aren't allowed. Why are you here? Hey guys. Um Rescue Stockton's caravan, that's interesting. Who are you? I'm asking the questions. Why are you here? That guy looks like Ben Affleck. I just came from Covenant. They said I should come here. If Jacob gave anyone permission, I would know about it. This ain't personal. Hmm. Missions must be protected. Well, it's personal now. Oh, nice. It killed him, too. Thanks for the key. Security helmet. I want that. Coven security. That's kind of cool. The intruder must be eliminated. It's true. I must. I'm going to end you all. Vault tech. That's interesting. Huh? No. Tape. You guys should really take the time to listen to these. Maybe I'll listen to that one. How about that? What is it called? Subject something or other? Where am I? Shh. No, no, no. How are the subject's vitals? A little unsteady, but who, who are you? What? Speak only when spoken to. Please continue. The subject is ready for baseline testing. Subject, answer the questions quickly and with what first comes to mind. You're approached by a frenzied scientist who yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. What's your response? What the f is that? That safe test. No! Answer the question. I, I, I don't know. I don't know science stuff. I ignore him. Ignore him, you say. Oh, fascinating. Life expectancy. Why would that be fascinating? Well, I'm sure we're about to find out. Get up! Get up! That didn't work out quite how I hoped it would, but that's alright. He came from over here. Oh, that's the chain door. Good. 
We have a way out. Let's continue. Oh. Well, there she is. Let's have a talk, Doc. <clears throat> and here you are. My life's work on the verge of ruin, all because of your efforts to find Stockton's supposed... Boy, your goggles. You do know she's most likely a synth, yes? If you are more than a hired gun, perhaps we can stop this before it's too late. I'll give you a fair hearing. How considerate. What would you do if your family was destroyed by a synth right in front of you when you were but a child? Would you roll over and accept it? Or would you do something about it? What happened to you? In Diamond City, a lifetime ago, my parents and eight others were massacred by someone. At first, we thought the maniac was human. But that was the day we learned of the Institute's latest creations, the Synths. As long as the Institute walks invisibly amongst us, they strike without warning and control us from the shadows. I've dedicated my life to devising a test to detect these hidden Synths, to root them out so they can be extinguished. Isn't that a goal worth fighting for? Yeah, but you're crazy. Hundreds of kidnappings over the years. Ask the survivors if it's really that bad. And there are so many other tragedies that may be their responsibility. Oh, now we're just speculating. Well. Hmm. You can't seriously I like, want to kill all the sins. I like Vin, you most certainly so. do. Valentine. Have to find them first. A living synth is indistinguishable from a human. Oh yeah, plus any Curie. Medical test yet devised. But it turns out psychology can detect a difference. Enter the safe test. The test is in Since its You're crazy. Image, but through sacrifice and perseverance, our success rate is improved. <laughs> At what cost? are barbaric. It's torture. To improve the safe test, intense psychological pressure must be applied to our test subjects. It is distasteful. You mean like all the necessary. blood that was downstairs Covenant in that one cell? is many things. A refuge for the broken people left in the wake of the Institute's rampages. A place of safety and healing. But most importantly, it is our one chance to end this age of paranoia. I will make you a deal. If you let me dispose of Stockton's sin and continue our work, I'll match whatever reward you were offered. Um. Don't kill the girl. Spare her. Impossible. The odds are too great she's an Institute infiltrator. Even if she is an unfortunate victim in this war, sparing her can compromise everything. You're just evil. Sorry. That's a deal I won't accept. You have violated your most sacred oath. Then you'll just have to kill me. Okay. Well, let's save it and find out if I can kill her and Carrie won't get mad at me. me away always with the needles questions and the pain stupid stupid questions over and over I'm Amelia Stockton I'm not a synth I believe you I just want this nightmare to end 
You saved me. Thank you. My father, old man Stockton, he will reward you. You can marry me. You're kind of cute. Yep. Sorry, Swanson. Curie, stay right here. No. May I be of assistance? Well, that's kind of cool. Whoa, what did I just do? Oh, I just stealthed. <laughs> Whoops. Hey, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Do you need something from me? Here. Yes. Hold. I will wait. It is safe here, yes? Uh, we have a nice quiet weapon, don't we? We can just stealth through and... We gotta go save what's-his-face. Whoops. Man, these were all bad people. Hey, let's go. Bye, Talia. Even the dock? Doc ran. Okay. Well, this is now mine. <laughs> <laughs> 